Hey, I'm Chef Caleb. Today we're going to be making fried chicken and spaghetti squash. It's going to be fantastic. Let's jump into this. First thing you need, one spaghetti squash, any size. The best way to, and easiest way to cut this is to cut the end off and then set it up on its side and off you go. So cut the end off, set it on its side, and then go all the way down. Two sides, take out the seeds, and then we'll put it in the oven. All right, now that we got our spaghetti squash in the oven, it's time to move on to the marinara. You need an onion to start. The easiest way to do an onion is to cut off both ends and then cut it down the middle. We're gonna use half an onion this time. So you're gonna peel it. Once you peeled it, you're gonna dice. Make some incisions all the way down, not cutting it all the way. See how I can hold this onion and it's not going anywhere? This is gonna make it for easy for dicing. And then make perpendicular cuts to the ones you just made. And there we have our diced onion. All right, into the pan it goes. And we're gonna let it saute until it's just translucent. Once you get your onions about three quarters of the way done, you wanna put your garlic in. Don't put it in too soon or you're gonna burn your garlic. So we've added our onions to our marinara sauce. Now we're gonna go ahead and add our tomato paste, our chicken stock, and our herbs. I'm using dried herbs here. You can totally use fresh herbs, but you'll wanna just add them at the end. Give it a stir, you're gonna let that simmer. Let's move on to the chicken. We got our two chicken breasts here. We're gonna dip it in the egg first, and then we're gonna pat it into the flour. So here we go, and there we go. We're gonna go right to the air fryer with this. All right, it's ready to get our chicken breast into the air fryer. If you're using an almond flour, you wanna use some pan spray and spray on the outside just to get it crispy. If you're using a traditional flour, you can skip this step. Now into the air fryer we go. About 20 to 25 minutes in your air fryer. Of course, grab your thermometer, 165 degrees is what you're looking for. All right, now comes my favorite part. We're gonna slice it, plate it, and eat it. Or you can skip to the favorite part, order it from Evolve, and I'll do the cooking and you do the eating.